my kitchen. My name is Nancy. Today I'm going to show you all how to make a party cheese ball. Um, this is a really great appetizer for any party you're going to have or game day coming up since football season's starting back up. The ingredients you'll need are very few and simple. You're going to need some cream cheese, some green onions, dried beef, Worcestershire and salt. Okay, and you want to make sure before you get started that your cream cheese is softened so it'll mix well with everything. So all we're going to do, you're going to mix in your green onions and half of your beef because we're going to roll the cream cheese and the beef, so the beef on the outside too. But you just want to put about half in the actual cheese ball. So that looks about good. Oh, and add our Worcestershire and salt. And we're going to mix this together till it's well combined. And like I said, this is a great appetizer for any party. I make this a lot. It's a really good crowd pleaser. It's delicious. And it's really simple. You can make this the day before or a couple days ahead of time. And it can just sit in the fridge. Okay, and once you have everything nice and combined, you kind of want to roll it all together to make a ball. So we can roll it into the meat. I'm going to try and roll it into a little ball already. It's going to get a little messy. And then you're just going to roll it in this meat. And like I said, you can use any meat you like. If you like pastrami, salami, you can even do pepperoni. But this is just some regular, just dried beef. All right, and you want to cover the whole thing. Now, once we have this covered, I'm going to wrap this in plastic wrap. And this needs to sit at least overnight, uh, about four hours it would be ready. But overnight's best. All right, and I'll show y'all what this looks like when we get to the next step. Okay, so our cheese ball's been in the fridge for about six hours. So we're going to serve it up. And I'm going to serve it on this cute little plate that I painted. I painted at one of those little paint parties. You know, you can drink wine and paint. And so I drank a little bit too much wine, so my lines are a little crooked. But it's okay. But it's perfect for this. The cheese ball can sit right in the center. And then you can serve this with whatever you want. Crackers, chips, anything like that. I like serving them with just some regular crackers. And just fan them all around. isn't picture perfect oh. all right let's give this a taste it's so tasty really delicious it's creamy it's salty with the beef and it's the perfect combination it's everything you want in a cheese bowl i hope you do give this a try the recipe and instructions will be listed down below. And thank you so much for watching.